How do people resist that and still have a career? Well, the big data, you know, it's a very tempting uh, idea. You could look at technological journals. They have issues devoted to big data. And it's easy to collect a lot of data these days. Like probably everything that's going on here is going right to a data bank in Utah where President Obama can read it if he wants. <laughs> and uh, that's uh, and everything that you send on email and everywhere else. So a lot of ways of collecting big data. Uh, also, working with big data is pretty easy. Uh, doesn't take a lot of thought. I mean, you have to maybe get a statistician to help you, but uh, then it just, uh, you get a lot of stuff with, without much effort, and without much thought. And that's tempting. The thinking is hard. Having ideas is hard. Uh, they often don't work. You know, you've got to pursue them and so on. So why not do something easy? Uh, and uh, so there's an ideology behind it. Uh, it. It can't be done in the in serious areas. Like you, you can't do it in. I mean, sometimes a lot of data can help for something. If you have a you have some some idea that you want to pursue, you can often test it by looking at data. But you have to know what you're looking for. You know, otherwise it's like. Uh, uh, suppose somebody says, uh, I want to become a biologist. Okay, and you tell them it's easy. Uh, just go to the Harvard Biology Department. They've got a big library. It's all there. Okay, just become a biologist. Uh, yeah, that's uh, big data. You can't do anything unless you know what you're looking for. You know what you're looking for, you have to have some understanding. You have to have a framework and so on. Uh, but the, the move towards it, you can see the temptation. And in fact, if you're a grad student or a young researcher and you want to get an NSF grant, uh, that's the way to do it. You know, put in a grant. In fact, it's very hard to get a grant these days unless you put in something completely irrelevant. <laughs> like I'm going to do a big study of collecting data or I'm going to use for linguistics uh, fMRI. Uh, not for any purpose, but just so I can buy a big machine, and you know, big machines are good. And so uh, uh, these are some of the pathologies of um, the research and funding. Got to get used to it. So I'm just doomed then. <laughs>